Hi Taurus, welcome back to my channel. We're doing your next 48. This is episode 25 and 26 for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and North Node. If you want to get a personal reading for yourself, you know what to do. Check that description box. Every single thing you need is there. What you see is what you get. All right, so let's see what's going on with my Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and North Node. Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and North Node, please. See, Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and North Node. What are the messages? Please and thank you. Okay, two more shuffles, Taurus. Sun, Moon, Rising, and North Node. What are the messages? Thank you so much. Okay. All right, let's go. You have the Ten of Cups, beautiful, to start off with. Ace of Swords, and then we have the Nine of Swords. We have the uh, we have the Star card showing up, could be an Aquarian, and then we have the Sun card. It looks like it looks like something that you were you're actually okay. Somebody here is making you laugh, but all the while it's like you're worried, you're paranoid. Maybe something feels like it's too good to be true. What they're saying is too good to be true. You can't believe it, even though it's making you happy. You're like, I can't believe them. They always say that. You know, you know, they're not. They're just saying that to me. So some, it's like somebody is speaking to you and you don't believe them. It's like they're being dishonest. But with the Ace of Swords, I feel like they are being honest with you. Okay, I'm getting too, like somebody is a nervous wreck. I'm getting somebody is drunk calling you or drunk text, texting you. They can't sleep. All right, it's like somebody's calling you in the middle of the night. Okay, because they're worried. They can't sleep. They can't stop thinking about you. All right, what is the Nine of Swords? What is the Nine of Swords energy? Okay, two cards. Seven of Swords and Eight of Wands. Okay, so and we have the chariot. So it does it does look like you're holding back what you want to say. Like I'm getting like somebody is texting you or calling you, but you're you're afraid to even answer the phone. You're gonna press ignore. You're gonna act like you're asleep. I see you. I see you staring, st sitting here in your bed up at night, staring at your phone. You see this person calling you, and you're not gonna respond. Are you like, man, should I respond? Should I not respond? I'm gonna act like I'm asleep. Are you gonna just press ignore, send them to voicemail? Because you're afraid of what they might say. You, I mean, you're just, you're, it's like you're afraid of somebody's lies. Okay? It's like somebody has you paranoid. You, you cannot trust this person. They, you see them as a liar, and that's just period. Okay? What's the Ace of Swords? What is the Ace of Swords, please? I'm getting somebody talks really fast. They say a lot at once. You're like, man, you're a liar. Everything you say is a lie. I don't believe anything you're saying. But I'm getting several messages. You're waking up to several messages. You're like, man, all it's all lies, all of it. What's the Ace of Swords? Ace of Swords, please. Okay, the judgment, justice. Okay, so this this tells me this card right here. So it could be a Libra that's calling you, but I'm I'm gonna tell you this. When I see this card, it's like this is long overdue. They are being honest and sincere. The justice card is it's almost like the universe is making them reach reach out to you. This is karmically meant to occur. Is this could be your justice? You don't believe them, but it's almost like they can't lie. They're under scrutiny right now. They're under judgment with the universe. So it's almost like if they are a, a, a liar, they're being forced to tell you the truth because they're undergoing a transformation. Nobody can escape death. Nobody can escape this. So it doesn't matter how smooth you are or, or how perceptive you are. Justice comes for everybody. Okay, so what's the Ten of Cups? I'm getting this person is being forced to tell you how, how much you make them happy. Like that you make them happy and they're being forced to tell you that. And I'm, I'm getting you're not going to believe it, but this is your justice. They need to... The situation needs to be balanced out and I'm getting you need clarity is what you're going to get. Now, this could be a call from your lawyer as well. OK, and you're, you're kind of worried about what the lawyer is going to say. You don't want to answer the phone. They call several times, but you're worried about what they might say. OK, what's the Ten of Cups? Yeah, we have the Knight of Swords. So I'm, I'm getting, okay, what's the Knight of Swords? I'm getting it's definitely a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. We have all the air signs here present. This could be just facets, facets of your character too. Or you could have a lot of air energy in your chart. Okay, but it's like you're getting good news out of nowhere. But I'm getting the Knight of Swords. What's the Knight of Swords energy? Yeah, the Ten of Pentacles. So this is really, this is actually a good Knight of Swords. All right, you're being somebody, you're getting a payout. So I'm getting two like... 
you wake up and you have you have a payout in your account unexpectedly. You wake up to this money and it's it's yours. You deserve it. It's 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 a payout. Maybe it's it's child support or something like that, or money you didn't even think was coming to you. It's coming. It, it's it's justice. Okay, but I'm getting somebody who's going to tell you how happy you make them. They want long term with you. Please, can we just be together? Somebody wants to get married. I'm getting somebody's like talking to you about marriage. And you're like, no, I, I cannot believe what you're saying. I'm sorry. You always say the same thing. Okay, this could be someone you're actually already married to. What's the justice card? What is the justice? The justice card, please. Yeah, the queen of wands. It could be a fire sign actually saying this to you, calling you. All right, but some, I'm, somebody wants to tell you, like, you know, you make me happy, you're beautiful, okay? Like, somebody is really laying it on thick, okay? So they could be offering you money, like, somebody's like, look, I'll, you know, whatever you need, I'll take care of you or whatever, okay? What is the, the uh, Seven of Swords and the Eight of Wands energy? Seven of Swords, Eight of Wands. I'm getting to somebody is speaking on your behalf or somebody is paying, somebody is helping you pay for a lawyer, or someone's like, yeah, I paid off the lawyer, or something like that, but something is being, something is justified, something, you're getting something that you want, and it's long overdue, you're long overdue for this justice, I'm getting, whatever this is, it's going to make you hella confident, you're going to come out on top, you're confident, you're sitting here like in all your glory, all right, what's the seven of swords and the eight of wands, seven of swords, eight of wands, please, Yeah, the four of cups. That's what I'm saying. This person always says this to you. And I'm getting to they're trying to butter you up. You're so beautiful. You're so this. You're so that. You're everything. You're amazing. You're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Tell me something I don't know. You always say the same things. We have the five of cups. Yeah, but I'm getting they are remorseful. I'm not getting any apology cards. I'm getting somebody that's very forceful, very, uh, they apply a lot of pressure on you. But they, they're, I'm not seeing them say sorry, though. Okay, what's the Knight of Swords? Let's give, them, let's give them a chance. What's the Knight of Swords? But I'm getting they are remorseful. They are regretful. They feel like they lost you or they lost something. Okay, Knight of Swords. Knight of Swords energy. Yeah, we have the Ace of Pentacles, Four of Swords. Yeah, so this person wants a new beginning with you after, have, after taking a break. You guys broke up. It was very temporary or they want it to be temporary. Like four days is enough. They're like, no, I don't want to. Four days is long enough. Four weeks is long enough. I want to be back together now. And I'm getting they want it now. So this is someone who's very pushy because, they, you know, they regret losing you. Okay, one more card to steal your reading. All right, four of cups. I'm not, I'm getting that you're, you just don't want to hear it, though. You're like, I don't know. Okay, what's the four of cups? Wow, you have a, several cards just flying out. We're going to, we have the full card, the hangman, and we have the, the, uh, the, the nine of wands. Yeah. So it's almost like you stopped listening to the BS and you went off and did your own thing because you saw somebody for who they truly were. It's just a bunch of words. You don't really see any proof here and you're just tired of dealing with it. You're tired of putting up with it. You're tired of them saying, sorry, you're tired of their gestures. You're just tired of this person. You know, I'm, I'm getting, I guess a little bit too late to, for that proof. All right. And we have the nine of pentacles. Now you're, you're okay. You want to be by yourself. You're, you're better off being single. You're tired of chasing someone. You're tired of begging for second chance, second and third chances. Or you're tired of them begging you. It's like you know what? I, let's just I'm just better off by myself. You know, let's just be friends. I don't I don't want to talk or anything. So I'm getting somebody's not going to really budge. But I'm getting somebody has somebody has you have tried and tried to make up with somebody. But they they just don't want to budge. You're like you know what? Fine, go do whatever you want to do. I don't care. I'm tired of chasing you or you're, uh, this person is you're tired of chasing them. You pick what side you're on. Okay, let, let me get a love card. Can I get two love cards for Taurus, please? Yeah, forgiving and learning. All right. We do have religious factors there. That tells me that this, this person is a, is a part of your spiritual journey. They have something that you need and vice versa. You have to, you need to learn how to forgive this person and learn from what you have been through. All right, maybe give them the benefit of the doubt, but I'm not saying that they apologize either. So maybe that's why you're like, no, you have to say you apologize to me. You can't keep putting me through shit and not saying sorry. But I'm getting, I'm getting somebody is not learning from their mistakes because we over here it's like this, it's still the same knight of wands, knight of swords. So it's like somebody is learning and somebody is not, and somebody is fed up with like being patient. This is what I'm getting here. All right, what's one more card for Taurus? One more card for Taurus, please.
Yeah, keep an open mind. Wow, interesting. Wedding. Wow. So I'm so I'm getting this person is actually your life partner. This is a very tumultuous. This is a very challenging relationship, but I'm getting this is the person that you're supposed to be married or you could already be married. But marriage means also to a very serious relationship, something that can turn into a marriage actual bound by law. But you guys are going to reconcile. I'm getting keep an open mind. Very interesting. This is your true love. Wow. I'm getting, I'm getting, it's, it's going to be a long time coming for this union. That's all I have to say. You know, five years from now, we'll be doing a reading and maybe it'll be better. But this is like, this is not going to be easy at all. I'm getting this is a this is this is like um this is a arranged marriage through the universe. You are you have to be with this person whether you like it or not is what I'm getting here. Um you have a karmic contract with this person. I'm sorry to tell you that. It's you you're meant to be with this person here. Um, I'm going to leave it there. <laughs> Don't forget to like the video, leave your comments and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.